A widely available blood thinning drug is being described as a game changer when used to treat seriously ill COVID-19 patients. The drug heparin is now being trialled in intensive care units across the world, including several in Australia. The lead researcher says if it's as successful as hoped, many lives could be saved. ICU wards full of seriously ill COVID-19 patients are the nightmare result of the coronavirus pandemic around the world. I'd been sick for weeks and I was sort of already resigned half to dying from my side effects of COVID. Patients are admitted, become seriously ill and require ventilation, with many succumbing to the virus. Now the common blood thinning drug heparin, if inhaled, is limiting lung damage and potentially saving lives. If it works as well as we think it does, it could be uh, a real big game changer. Professor Frank Van Haren from the Australian National University is leading the worldwide research. Also the Director of Intensive Care at Sydney St George Hospital, he knows all too well the plight of COVID-19 patients. Heparin also works against the virus that causes COVID-19, so it stops this virus from being able to get into the lungs and get into the cells. The results show that once heparin is administered, ICU patients stop declining and in 70% of them, breathing and oxygen levels start to improve. The results published today are from 98 patients in ICUs in two American and one Argentinian hospital. They are not from controlled trials. Now Professor Van Haren is leading a research effort that will see controlled trials in hospitals in 13 countries across the world, including Australia. We want to see if we can stop patients from needing to go on a breathing machine, stop patients from needing to go to intensive care. For Sonia Heaney, any help was vital as she battled the effects of the virus. All I know is some of my doctors describe me as being comatose. I was not on this planet. Four hospitals in New South Wales and Victoria are taking part in the trials. And Professor Van Haren says if heparin is shown to improve patient outcomes, it could be implemented almost immediately. Gordon Taylor, ABC News, Canberra.